Mother told me the Moonlit Fair will start once the wishing... All paths converge. Exactly. Thanks to you, every wish has been fulfilled. As for what I'm doing, <laughs> consider it some kind of after-sales service. I light and hang the fulfilled wishes. When the wisher cannot do it themselves, I do it for them. Then we can do it together next year. I had just finished with the last one before you arrived. Most of the fulfilled wishes had already been put up during the festival. There weren't many left from the beginning. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You've already been a huge help. It's your first time celebrating Moon Chasing Festival in Jinjo. You deserve to have more fun. I can handle the rest on my own. Yes, you deserve to have fun and rewind. Taking a necessary break is not a waste of time. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. As the festivities wind down, the moonlit fair's stalls remain open. Perhaps you'd like to visit for one last round. You may even find some deals and specials at this time. Having been to the fair every year, I always make time to explore the stalls that catch my interest. Stay with us in Jinjo for a couple more years, then I'm sure you'll become very familiar with the fair too. <laughs> Indeed, I find joy in scientific research, immersing myself in data and theories, verifying various possibilities. It's a blissful experience. But sometimes, taking a break from work to join the jubilant crowd brings a different kind of joy. stall. <laughs> You've probably been there already. Uh, but if I have to choose one... <sighs> Shall I just show you in person? Yes. I remember you seemed to enjoy it last time. With your exceptional prowess in combat, I bet you're good at shooting, too. Then, may I suggest something more challenging? Moon Shooter is very popular. While the stall owner changes the targets daily, the frequent use has caused some wear and tear. That's why we need to lower the muzzle a bit, make it easier to hit the bullseye. Now here's the exciting part. Rotate the gun slightly and align it with the rabbit's ear. Then you may hit two targets simultaneously. It's all about finding the right angle, and the bullet might rebound toward the next one. Yes, you'll need to use the right angle and utilize the momentum. It's kind of like stone skipping. I first tried it two years ago. On a good day, I could hit three targets at once. They've been using my record as a promotional gimmick, offering an exclusive souvenir to anyone who can break it. <laughs> good. I was a bit worried it wouldn't interest you. If 
I were to try that, I'd have to calculate the bullet trajectory to two decimal places. Which technically isn't impossible with my prosthetic hand. But I'll probably get banned from ever playing again. Rover, I'll stick to using my left hand to keep it a safe and fair competition. <laughs> well, jokes aside, I value the process more than the outcome. To me, it's all about having a good time. After all, this isn't a scientific inquiry, and there's no end goal. We're here to enjoy ourselves, and I want to do that to the fullest. What do you think? <laughs> Glad we're on the same page. Uh, can I make a request, then? Will you join me for next year's Moon Chasing Festival? <laughs> you heard me. The idea came to me as we gazed at the moon side by side. While I'm not sure where you'll be, or what you'll be doing then, I want to invite you anyway. I'm not planning to have you help me with the wishes at Moon Tree Lodge again. Maybe we'll try another game of moon shooting. Or go sample some new treats at Yum Yum Haven. Or we'll just follow the crowd and see where it takes us. Though it's still a long time before next year's celebration, I can't help but imagine what we might do together. I don't have a specific plan yet, but with you, Rover, I have a feeling it's going to be fun. you made for next year's moon chasing festival as the caretaker of moon tree lodge and a xiangli yao i promise to make it come true 